Hello my friend, this is Mohamed Intiaz. Welcome back to my channel, I've got uh, trips and tricks. A very long time I did not upload a new tutorial. Sorry for that, but today uh, I started to be uploading and I bring for you a very important topic today. Uh, that uh, oh, I get uh, one of a couple of comments that uh, they need to know how to take the coordinates from a Google Earth. Any land, any building, any existing site, any uh, whatever line you have you need to take the coordinates from Google Earth it's very easy I find the solution for you that which you can use and make coordinates directly to your AutoCAD but before start the tutorial I need to tell you that if you're not subscribed yet my channel please subscribe and uh, hit the bell icon so when I uploaded a video you will get a notification my channel always create the tutorials that the, when the people stuck in AutoCAD so we find a solution and we create a tutorial for you okay now we have as you can see that uh, we have uh, this uh, Google Earth I already downloaded to the uh, my uh, to my laptop uh, but if you need to know if you need to know how to download this one I will give uh, in the description link you can download from there and so let's start with how to uh, how to use this and how to make uh, coordinates on Google Earth. This is the land normal. Uh, I select any random building, but I need to create the coordinates here. But before started, I will tell you directly click directly click. It will not give you here any coordinate. It will give you latitude and longitude none. So let's start it. This is the this is the at place mark as you can see here. I'm going to click here. Okay, so it will give you a place mark. Uh, just wait. Okay, we have at place mark here. As you can see, if you click, if you place anywhere this one, it will change the latitude and longitudinal value. This latitude and uh, uh, longitudinal value we cannot use in AutoCAD but we have to convert into AutoCAD I will tell you how to do it first of all let's let's adjust this one uh, this at place mark I need the corner of the building what how much we can make zoom and how much we can adjust adjust it and place at the corner okay now this is placed I place it this one now latitude and longitudinal changed here but I need to convert into coordinates so we have a website first of all copy this one copy this one and go to that website we will paste there our as you can see here movable dash type dot co dot uk this website will help you it's actually like a converter of unit converter but it's not it's a latitude and longitudinal converter as you can see here latitude and longitudinal value already have here but I need to paste my one here we already copy the north one so I placed here paste here my north value okay now go back to Google Earth to copy the east longitudinal value So I paste here. It will change here. You can see the, the UTM coordinate. It will convert into UTM coordinate after I paste. Okay. Uh, this one uh, grid reference. We no need that one. And this one here, uh, meter in seconds. It will uh, change the value. Here you can see that you should use not meter. It will you you have to use mm. So you can see that after the dot, we we will get the survey value okay so uh, let's paste that uh, uh, longitudinal uh, east value I paste it here then I click out it will change it as you can see that it will it is it's already zoom the area it already zoom the area and it, it take the coordinate okay so let's copy this value We'll going to take this value into into coordinates. Okay, I already opened my AutoCAD. Okay, 
okay now we have AutoCAD here but first of all what I will do I will paste this value into uh, any notepad okay just a second please okay we came it okay we will reduce the size of this and even we will open and we will reduce the size of the AutoCAD also to be C one time okay now we have here the fresh new sheet here I open nothing we have okay so what we will do first of all we will change the UCS of the file we will make into world okay UCS enter Just a minute okay we will change into world already we have we'll type again w sorry again u c s enter uh, w enter we'll change already the ucs value now we will we will take these coordinates here i will type c normally people will type point okay but I will type C so the circle will create and will that circle center will it, uh, center will have this coordinate okay so I'll type C into I will take the first value six seven six seven three five eight zero point five nine three okay comma I will type the east value two seven two five Three five five point five five two. Enter. Okay, this circle created already. Let's make a zoom all. Z enter a enter. Okay. Now we have here circle. The circle of the center have this coordinates. If you take the plot four coordinates, you will get four circle. If you use the circle. For the coordinate, if you can, then you can make the line from plotting outline. Out, um, uh, outline you can create. But let's check these coordinates come exactly or not. So I will type ID. You should change the UCS into W. Huh? Don't forget to that one. I type ID. And I click the center. And I'll take this value. I need to paste this. Sorry. Sorry, but I can bring back that. Okay, no need. Sorry for that. I'll go back again one more time. No issue. Repeat ID. I will click here. Then copy. paste here as you can see here the same coordinates came here okay. and if you need this website link you can go to through my description you can uh, directly click from there okay this is the unit converter of latitude and longitudinal values watch my other related google earth related tutorials like you capturing image and import to AutoCAD. Okay. You can find the link in the at this description. Thank you. I hope you like it. So please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. So when I uploaded a video, you will get a notification. If you have any doubt, please uh, you can give me a comment and I will create for you a tutorial on that. Okay. I hope you like it. Thank you. Take care of yourself. Stay safe. Bye-bye.